Hello everybody, my name is Messer Ruffles and welcome to another game of Planetary Annihilation. Today, we're going to be playing on this new system that I made. It has a gas giant, a metal planet, and a desert template. All the players that are in the system will spawn on the desert template, so pretty much it's going to be an all-out free-for-all to see who can control this planet. And then afterwards, there will probably be a mad dash to the metal planet, and then someone will probably, unless they're completely retarded, move their commander to the metal planet and then fire upon the desert template and kill everybody there that's still standing. Now here's the thing about gas giants. Gas giants are right now in my opinion massively unbalanced due to the fact that you only need a couple jigs on the gas giant in order for you to make a metric ton of metal so yeah whoever controls the gas giant will definitely I think in my opinion win this entire match. I'm just saying. So we gotta hope that nobody tries to go for an Astraeus early on and get that gas giant because once they do, it's pretty much over for us. Granted, maybe I'm a little bit of a worry wart. Maybe I'm a tad too pessimistic. Who knows? It's really gonna go with the two factory build. In fact, you know what? Hey, Catbird, this is what I think of your build orders. This is what I think of your build orders, Catbird. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Anyway, same sort of schlock, get out a ton of metal extractors around our base, and then afterwards build up a power plant or two. In fact, we already have a power plant 40% of the way there, so that's pretty good. Actually, we might want to let this go down with the dinosaurs because it is blocking out that metal extractor over there. Yep, there we go. And awesome. Yeah, unfortunately, there's still the glitch where if you do plop up a building right next to the metal point, then you can't build a metal extractor. Kind of sucks. It's always, in my opinion, one of the worst glitches. That and just the servers. I think I would be a little bit more happier with Planetary Annihilation if the servers were a tad better and there wasn't that glitch. Because that glitch sometimes really pisses me off. I remember I only spawned with about two mexes one time, and then the glitch essentially... Uh, happened to both of those max points and completely fucked over my groove and I was destroyed economically throughout the entirety of the match kind of sucks it was a free for all too so my spawn was incredibly shit but the person I was versing off against right next door ooh he had he had the greatest spawn ever he had like 10 maxes compared to everybody else he was basically the Saudi Arabia of the max fields alright then so more power plants always a good thing probably go ahead and continue having more fabricators help out the commander with this power plant production. Okay, so far so good. I don't see anybody right next to me. This could change. Nope, nobody right next to me. Wow. Oh, that was a giant lie. Red isn't right next to me, but he is fairly close, I guess. Should actually try and expand a little bit more up north over here. Let's see, radar, do you see that area? Yes, you do if you had energy you don't have. Okay, so just claim these max points. And you two should team up. Become the superheroes of the Fabricator world. In fact, now that I have five Fabricators, let's go ahead and focus on energy plant production with y'all, and then afterwards, we can just get our commander to go on factory production. There's an air factory. And afterwards, we'll build a bunch of vehicle factories. Okay, okay, keep going down. Go, go, go. And again, we need to get out as much air as we can in the mid game so that we can deal with those bomber snipes. Because from what I've been hearing so far, bomber snipes in FFAs are pretty darn deadly. And from what I've seen, oh man, they completely destroy armies. Again, a couple spinners are always nice, but. Then again, you know, the Hummingbird, don't underestimate it. It's an incredibly good unit. I mean, Spinners are also awesome, but we also need Hummingbirds. We need both. I wish there was more options for anti-air, but nope. Unfortunately, there's not. So I guess once their unit roster is updated a little bit more, they will have more options for units. Well, more options for different types of units. Okay, let's get out more radar. That would be red again. 
Red knows where I am. That's the problem that I have right about now. He could be all the way on the other side of the planet, but the issue here is that he knows where I am, so he's going to try and target me first. In fact, there we go. He's already moving his booty all the way there. Let's try to get another radar a little bit closer to Red's base. Right now, power production is getting better and better as we continue building up. Shit. Radar. You're supposed to tell me when the bad guys were gonna come. Radar. Oh well, so now we have another opponent. That's right next to it, that would be yellow. Seems like red has a ton of fabricators just chilling out over here. I think they're air fabricators, though I could be wrong. If they're sea fabricators, I would be really confused. Simply because naval fabricators are tad tad useless in my opinion. Air fabricators do what sea fabricators do, and can also build on land. Also, naval units are still a tad useless in my opinion. Ah, that would be orange. Hello there, orange arena. He has a ton of doxes, and he's just now probably getting out some uh, vehicles. So far, so good. We are tracking him. Oh, no. That's bad. You were supposed to tell me. Why don't you tell me shit? Radars. Oh. I guess my radars have that little annoying glitch. Okay. Well, we can kill Red's commander, which is good. No, we might not be able to. Let me go ahead and get her up my forces and retreat back. We won't be able to. We should be focusing on is dealing with this attack by White. This is so annoying. We're surrounded by the red power, the white power down south, and to the west, we'll just be yellow over there. What we need to do is pump out enough military units. Or not military units, but yeah, actually, yeah, enough military units to try and push back against this mighty, mighty white horde. We might not be able to actually get out tier two, which is a little bit suckish. I don't see any air units from white actually. It could be possible that if we tech on over to Bumblebees, could destroy his army. Go ahead and do that. Let me also check out his base. Let's see what he's building. Okay, he's he's gonna die. If we yeah, we're gonna tech on over right about now. So let's keep these units for now and then afterwards, Bumblebees. I'm gonna have my army just chill out up north over here just in case Red does anything stupid. Commander can probably go ahead and first and foremost get some missile turrets because we need some missile turrets and afterwards you can go ahead and pop up a vehicle factory. Alright then friends continue producing bulbies. Stat. We can have these fabricators go down south and help out the commander with some much needed tier 2 metal. Uh, not metal but vehicle factory production. We should get out metal storage and energy storage pretty soon. Seeing as though we are going to get out a ton of extra metal and energy pretty soon once the tier 2 factory is done and then we get out an advanced fabricator. Now I think red is currently scared shitless of orange and me so he's not going to be too much of a threat anymore which is good. White on the other hand might still want to play a few rounds in the ballpark if you know what I mean. Be a little bit cautious with him. Red has left orbital. Well, not. Oh no, no, he hasn't actually left for orbital space. That's good. He's about to. He has the building now, and he probably will have the eco pretty soon. So we're gonna have to go ahead and get out an umbrella, and afterwards an orbital deep space radar. Remember, once one of the players goes to the gas giant, it's pretty much game over. Right now, I'm just buying my time. Dealing with the players right next to me, and then afterwards, I'm probably gonna go ahead and maybe do a little bit of inward. Per I guess not inward protection, but inward perfection. So just focus on myself, my own empire, a little bit. 
All right, Bombies. Lower the health a little bit. And there we go. There's White. Did lose a ton of units, though. Unnecessary losses, to be honest. With him all donged out, we can now focus on Red. Wait, hold on. Get that umbrella out. Hmm, what's going on over there? What are you doing with those orbital fabricators? Are you planning on reclaiming my stuff? That's a no bueno. What is he planning on doing with those orbital fabricators? Eh, oh well, I guess we'll figure that out pretty soon. Still not finished yet. Ah, he's gonna do that. Damn, he has a ton of of eco. Is he, if he's able to do that? Whoa, the reclaim for the orbital fabricators is massive. Well then, let's try to get some orbitals now. Not orbitals, but some some much needed um anti-orbital. Guns right about now. Whoa, I'm, I'm just surprised by the reclaim. Okay, speed that up. Speed that up. You know what? Let me shut this down really quick. Whoa. Good golly. Did not expect that whatsoever. Oh well, let's just go in hot, I guess. God, he's being a little bit of an annoying pest. Just a tad, just a tad. Go ahead and rebuild my air factory production. Bombers, you can chill out over here. Should probably just focus all of our efforts on Red, as he is currently a rising superstar. Oh, put you guys in group one. Where you at, girl? Yeah, there we go. Good little doggies. Good. And now we should get some tier two maxes. All right, keep on a building. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, there's absolutely nothing in the space. Is it because he has the gas giant? No one has the gas giant. Same one have the metal plant? No. Whoa. Did this commander even leave this planet? Or is he just gonna build anchors? Okay, now I kind of get what he did. But I don't understand why I can't see it right about now. Oh, no, I see it. Yeah, I saw it for a second. I saw his base. It's on the gas giant. This now makes a whole bunch of sense. Alright, well, you know what? Let me go ahead and take these guys. Use them for my adventure production. Whoa, 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 okay. Oh, god damn. There's so much production going on. No, please aim there. There we go. Good god, these orbital fabricators are super annoying. Trying to get to take care of these guys is gonna be a pain in the Fatusha. Oh, well, there we go. There goes his hopes and dreams. Thank God for that. Okay, now I don't know where his commander is. Granted, I don't know where anybody is. It's so weird. 
Oh, did I not build the orbital deep space radar? Holy shit. That's weird. Thought I queued that up. Oh well. Now we can figure out where red is. Okay, red is on the metal planet and Well. Black's on the gas giant, GG. So guys, black probably has the best eco in the entire game. Oh well. Go ahead and have my commander continuing to build up tier two. Tier two metal, come on, come on. And we'll also get out some tier two vehicle factories. We need a better military. I mean, we've kind of been on the back burner for some time now. Just dealing with red shenanigans and all the other shenanigans that come our way. Now, let's see. Should I have these guys go on energy plant duty or should I have the commander? Probably the commander with a couple of fabricators helping him out. Oh, that would be blue. Hello, blue. And there's orange. Red space is a tad bigger than I usually have. What? What? Oh, there's blue. I guess red is going to use this opportunity to just scout about. Yeah, go ahead. Kill all my stuff. See what happens. Red definitely has it out for me. Ah, oh, that's Marncorn. Hey, Marncorn. How you doing? Alright, then metal's done. And now we'll just focus on metal with our on our commander. I mean not our other commander, our other units. It's it's for the best, I guess. Alright then. Can we take out green stuff? I would love to. I don't have any vision of green. Could probably get out in orbital. Let me go ahead and move my units to Green's border. You lovely chaps can go ahead and get me. In fact, give me another air factory. That would be even better. Just get out a couple of spy planes, actually. Ooh, a pink and red. Battling for the metal planet. I cannot wait, to be honest. I'm gonna tell two of my factories to just go ahead and just spam me a bunch of spinners. Should probably lay up on the bumblebee production and go into some hummingbirds. Especially since now green is moving forward. Alright then, army, scout all green. What is over here? Well, just a couple of vehicles. A couple of tier 2 of vehicles as well. Not a huge amount of them. Now we'll just get a little bit more. Just get a little bit more stuff. All our shellers pile up and we can try to, I guess, shrek his army before he even thinks about coming against us. Before he even has the thought about even finding us. We're going to destroy him with the shellers. In fact, let me go ahead and move forward. I mean, right now he's kind of flanked between me and King Midas. So, I mean, King Midas can just like move forward and lick up all of the juicy green bits. Red makes it go faster. Alright then, you schlocks, go ahead and bombard that area. Oh, there's Black's commander. You know what? I want to build Avengers now. Okay, commander. Oh, well, fine, right? Yeah, you're you're all good. You can focus on more important things, right? How about them orbital units? Let's go ahead and get that. We 
We should probably just move forward with all of my units. I don't know whether or not I can win an engagement against them. I guess it's gonna come down to a numbers game and to an eco game. Simply because we are rocking out the same army compositions. Well, this might help a little bit. I'm an air attack right about now. He is coming in through this narrow choke point over here. So, I mean, it's not like he's safe from harm. In fact, he's going into harm's way right about now. Going to lose some of his units over here. Yeah, we should be able to deal with this. We do have enough spinners to keep afloat for now. Yeah, I think for the most part we should be fine. All he's built is hummingbirds, actually. I thought there were some bombies in here, but nope, there's not. Yeah, we could just kill Green right about now. Come on, Green, go to sleep. Go to sleep, Green. Go to sleep. Oh, wait, wait, wait. hold on. I want to build defenders. Shit. Oh, well, spaghetti -o. I mean, there's no anchors here. So, gotta build those Avengers. Build them quick, build them fast. And I'm thinking if we have enough units left over, we're just going to go ahead and march on over to yellow. Ooh, he's probably pissed off because yellow's attacking him right now. Oh, that ain't fun, bro. It's not fun at all. Kind of like getting your toes scrapped off by your cat. Never a good sign. You gotta spray a hose on that pussy. My advanced radar. Can you see down south? You cannot see black space. Okay, that's gonna be a little bit of a problem. I'm gonna have to go and try and fix that later on. Ooh, come on, keep dying, keep dying. Go to sleep, green. Go to sleep. Sleep time. I guess another advanced radar would be pretty good, just so I can see down south what's going on. I don't know what Orange has been doing. Oh, Orange is AFK. Never mind. That's what he's been doing. Nothing. Nothing at all. You guys, focus on the big picture. The levelers. Not the power plants. Yes, there we go. There we go. Now reinforcements are coming in. Kind of like the Soviets and the Americans dividing up Nazi Germany. Like, oh, I'll take this side. You take that side. Ooh, thank you, friend. What's going on with... What's going on here? Purple, red, pink. It's a giant smorgasbord over the metal planet. I need more fabricators straight away. Then keep on moving forward. Yes, yes. Black is getting kicked out of this planet. Oh, ho, ho, that is brilliant. Brilliant. So close to dying, too. But nope, he will live. He will survive. Doing everything in my power to try to destroy Green, but right about now, he is too so much T2. Dead and Slammers are pretty much gods at upcoming conversations. Though we have more numbers than him, so I'm not too worried. Okay, we should probably go ahead and build some orbital fabricators. I'm not too worried about a nuke coming out, which is good. Because a nuke would probably be a really, really dumb investment for any of these players to make. Since it would cost a ton of resources. The lead come on this planet still? Should really get out of advanced radar. Oh, 
Oh, really? Catapult spam? Oh, it's good that he's doing catapult spam still. Okay, we don't need any anti air anymore. He's not going bombers. He has a ton of catapults. He's just hoarding. He's just basically fending us off with just mass, mass hordes of catapults. Question, does he have any umbrellas? No, he doesn't. Interesting, okay. I think what I'm going to end up doing is setting up maybe either a laser command, um, not a laser commander, a laser platform, or maybe I can set up something like, I don't know, a couple of anchors going around and basically bombarding his base. He is going to escape pretty soon though. Let me go ahead and stop that. Avengers, move forward. Go, mighty Avengers, go. Looks like he has no forces, but in reality, he has tons, tons and tons of units, all willing to die for the Emperor. Ah, Yellow's over there. Hi, Yellow. How you doing? Yellow must have been killed by somebody else. Please, for the love of God, please die. Building way too much shit. Orbital factory, go. Really? You're building the Vulcans? That's a lot of wasted eco. Friendo Jim Bob. Jimbo Bob Pants. Here's what I think of your catapults. Deal with it. Deal with it, son. I should really gather up more bumblebees so that I can try and snipe that commander. Uh, Avengers dead. Good. But he has an umbrella. Okay, so that goes my um overall plan. Oh well. Let's go ahead and just produce more tier 2 vehicle factories. Building orbital fabricators over here. Actually, you know what? No, 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 no. Give me some advanced power plants. And we'll get some tier 2 vehicle factories over here. There we go. There we go. This is the right answer. Slammers, please die faster. Well, let's see. Battle planet, how's it coming along? Pink is dominating, red's dead. Purple has that area of the gas planet. Yeah, all around, not good stuff. Not good stuff at all. We haven't done any substantial damage to his eco because he's been producing a ton. Ton of stuff. We, we didn't hit the fabricators for a while and now we finally are. It's currently being destroyed. Okay, this is pretty much it. Radar, you can move forward, and y'all can probably go ahead and focus on something else. Actually, let's go ahead and just no, 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 not that. Let's go ahead and get some Avengers, just mass Avengers. You know what? It's time to get out levelers. Come on, leveler time. Do we have any spare advanced fabricators? Yes, we do. Time for an anti nuke. I just want to be protected. I want enough protection. I have to admit it. Green has done very, very well at keeping back my army and Yellow's army. I feel like Shellers might be a little bit useless against ground units. 
Yeah, they probably are. I should have probably tacked on over to levelers earlier. Oh well. It's pretty much all GG for him. God, why are my rally points so stupid? There we go. Way better. And we still have enough storage to boot. It's impressive. I just wonder if Yellow's ever going to claim the gas plant now. Oh, no, wait, wait. He backed off. So now it's only just purple and black. No pink. No love for pink. We have to do God, dealing with pink is going to be the worst thing ever. Be like, oh, he has all these anchors here. You know, when I did practice, well not, well, not practice, when I did get almost obliterated by all of that nonsense that was essentially the orbital fabricators from Marncorn, I wonder, just now, could I, have, could I do that to some of his buildings? Let's go ahead and check that out. Let's go ahead and see if maybe it can work out for my taste as well. Go ahead and deal with that. You think I don't see you? Oh, shit, of course I see you. Do you see what I see? Oh, probably now is the time for the age of the hummingbird because I just saw pink completely obliterate that dude. Now is about time we probably set up a nuke. Because I'm getting tired of this shit. What's going on over there? These units are phasing in and phasing out. It's insane. Yeah, this is really bad. Green holding on for dear life. Pink still in the game. Purple still in the game. And it's just endless, endless, stupid war. Like if these were actual human beings, this would be worse than maybe all of the great wars of Europe put together. Go ahead and get up some catapults actually over here so that we can defend against an inevitable pink attack. Okay, nuclear missile launcher is done. Good. Let's rush it out. Maybe with these anchors we can whittle down his forces. Maybe. die already how do you still have the resources I just don't understand it I can't even use the nuke on pink I mean not pink on green ah oh, no wonder why okay now he has tons of ooh that's not good he has tons of vehicle factories just absolutely massive amounts of vehicle factories Oh, fuck. Oh, 
that's it. It's over for us. It's over. Pink's coming in. I have no way to deal with it. Oh, you could nuke space. I wonder if a nuke would work. It might. We can try it out. Can't believe he has that umbrella there. It's the only thing keeping me back. You know what? Everybody just go around that one leveler. And just glob up together. Super glob. Away. Avengers. Do something. There we go. Oh no, he's moving. Shit. Don't be a little shit. Come on, lassie. Okay, we need to get those tier two metal extractors right over there. I thought I wouldn't need this much metal, but you know what? Apparently I do. of it no I'm gonna go ahead and fire at him no oh, shit he has anti nukes never mind these fly cannons aren't really working out too much Yep, these black cannons aren't working out all too well at all. Why? I'm not I'm not sure why they didn't do actually the damage I wanted them to do. Well, we were saved. that much they were saved oh my god Ugh. the annoying part is that this battle is continuing but he's still alive that's that that's the issue it's like there's almost no damage being done to him at least now i have enough forces to deal with yellow i mean not yellow green might be able to push on forward and maybe can't take out his commander finally. Oh, come the fuck on, Grain. Come the fuck on, man. Really? Really, man? You want to be that guy?
But now, most of my shit is being destroyed by two slammers. Come on, where's that commander? Where is that commander from green? It's a shame, we got so bogged down in our conflict with green that now pink has his entire planet under his control. Where the fuck is Green's commander? Okay, I'm gonna try and take out all these air factories right about now. With the use of my orbital. God, green, green, you idiots. Why don't you deal with pink? I swear to God, I was thinking about this while versing off against green. Like, I feel like maybe they're just teamed up against me. I feels that way though. But at the end of the day, maybe I'm just paranoid. Is this gonna work? I don't think it's gonna work. Yeah, pink won. There's no, there's no way of beating him back. We, we just, we just stuck to our guns way too long. There's no way. Even if we won this battle against green, it's just kind of like a formality sake because we just stayed on this planet for way too long. Like I even said, like, if we don't get off of this planet soon, we're probably going to lose. Should have gotten levelers early. Way, way earlier. <gasps> yes! Oh my god, thank god. Alright. Now we can survive, even though it's pretty much too late at this point. I can't believe the flak doesn't do that much damage anymore. Like, is Hummingbird now the best solution? That's a little bit dumb in my honest opinion. I gotta check out the replay after to see how he was able to get so many units. Do I have any fabricators available? Yeah, I do. Alright, I need these guys to go ahead and get me some air factories. Straight away. This air war is gonna be... What the... What? I'm confused. Um... What? <laughs> what is he doing? Is that a tactic? Oh my god, he's actually doing drops but with slammers? Drops used to be effective. Used to be effective. And now they're just shit. Why would you ever use drops with slammers? I can get vanguards. I can get that. But slammers? They don't survive. Come on. Come on. Time to get to you. Oh, no more no more Avengers. We already have the portable space locked down. This commander should really chill out and speed up production of something. 
How do we not have any advanced fibers anymore? That's crazy. Alright, I guess we're gonna have to settle with tier 2 for now. We're not tier 2, uh, tier 1 for now. It's a shame that the- Oh, hey there. How are you doing? Yeah, this mission has been largely successful in reclaiming all these little factories. Showing Pink's production slowly and slowly. You see how much how much easier it is? Like our life is just a hundred times better now that we only have to deal with one opponent. We do have to deal with yellow though, and we left yellow alone for quite a long time. I just want to get away from yellow right about now. To a lesser extent, get away from everybody. If I attack yellow, he's probably just going to go aggro on me. So I don't really want to do that. What are the tier 2 fabrics? There. So we did lose the majority of them. That kind of sucks. We're getting there. We're getting there against Pink. Kick him off of this planet. I don't know how we're going to face him on the metal planet, though. <laughs> he will get out that catalyst. I will guarantee you that. Nobody's on the metal planet. Interesting. You know what? You guys, go ahead. Give me some stuff on the metal. Oh, the gas planet. Straight away. Good, more air factories. More AA. More. I wonder, is there any umbrella support? No, there's not. Let's move in. Yeah, we're claiming these catapults that he's building. These catapults are all around super annoying and very, very, very cost effective. Avenger squad. Oh. Good job moving into my front lines over there. Okay, awesome. Let's go ahead and get some jigs. Come on, jiggy jiggy jig. Go ahead and get some anchors as well. God damn, gas planets are huge. Look at that metal drain. There goes all of our eco. But at the end of the day, it's probably worth it. Okay, you guys. Be the finest metal extractors in the land. First and foremost, I have to ask: Does anybody like some tier two? I mean, someone has to like tier two, right? Yeah. Well, you're in luck. We finally have some tier two fans fabbers. Oh, there's so much air. It's obnoxious. Oh, what do you think is the most annoying unit we can spam out? Ah, oh, a bunch of air units. Aha! Okay, you guys have the brightest job ever. Your job is to essentially go ahead and get some tier 2 metal chapters. Come on. Chop, chop. I don't pay you with Dogecoin for nothing after all. Where are the air units? Where did they come from? 
What is this? Is this is this really a thing? Are you landing your guys with stresses? I mean Yeah, oh well. You wanna do that, that's fine. Seems like Ping is retreating back. Why is he retreating back? Oh that's why. He has a friend. Well, I think now the spam wars are finally over. We are the spam gods. Maybe. I don't know. Right now, right about now, I just do not feel good about myself in this game. It's a bit long-winded, let's just put it like that. He still hasn't set up the catalyst, though, for whatever reason. Trying to get as many jigs as I can set up. The problem is that we waste so much metal on this. All right, with the death of Pink's invasion force over here, comes the rise of our empire. You know what? Let's go back to producing anchors. Do we still need a ton of air units? I don't think so. Oh, no, no, wait. We have yellow. I forgot about him. There's always another player we have to worry about. That's the sucky part. Let's just go back. Go back to home base. Try to salvage what we can. Maybe Yellow's an extremely bad player. If that's the case, then we might be able to win, but I'm not sure. Right now, I wouldn't count my chickens on it. Let's go ahead into the heart of Yellow's base, see what he's up to. Still, these Astraeuses are very weird. I don't know what its game plan is for them. I think that's what I'm finding hard to believe, what its possible game plan would actually be. Really? We well, have an anti-nuke over here. Maybe we should probably go ahead and get a little bit more anti-nuke production. Where are my orbital peppers? They're coming. Oh, she be coming around the mountain when she comes. She'll be coming around the mountain when she comes. Yeah, what is it? One nuke? Yeah, it's only one. Alright, so one anti-nuke and then we're all set. It would be hilarious if he just nukes my army and that's it. Because it would be so pointless. Because, I mean, that's not the reason why we're shrekking. It's because of our eco. Friendarino. that Antinuke and y'all can just die because I I'm sorry but you got a waste of space at this point oh whoa he nuked yellow that is the plot twist of legends okie dokie so you know what I can go ahead and continue rampaging pink space this is just a really weird game guys like I mean I'm always thinking oh yellow and pink teaming up with each other and stuff because they didn't attack me, but no, they didn't attack each other because they were lazy. Why didn't I think of that? Yeah, they've been really lazy, I guess. I mean, I'm sorry, but when you do nothing for most of the game, I, I kind of think you're a little bit lazy.
please, for the love of God, get me more jigs. Ah, more metal storage. Yes, yes. Oh, I feel so much better about myself now. Okay, there's the rest of Yell's base. Right, you know what would be awesome? Huh? We just set up a little advanced radar right over there. Just right over there. We should probably begin a mass. Mass. <laughs> orbital buildup of Avengers. Because we're going to have to try and break through Pink's control, which is massive. And slowly and slowly we will deal with Yellow. I think I might have enough forces to deal with Yellow, actually. But who knows? Who knows? Nobody knows. Oh, no, no, don't get shellers. Don't get shellers. Big dummy. Ah, where is he? He's right over there, chilling out. Yeah, he won't be able to actually set up the catalysts. From what I can tell. Okay. The reason why is because he has factories blocking some of the catalysts. Oh, he is building one. God bless. He has the building blocks for it, but he needs to have some. He needs to do some changes. All right. You know what? As awesome as my team up with Yellow could be, I would like to state, for the record, that we need. An actual plan to deal with the catalyst. So right about now, let's get the Avengers. Well, not the Avengers, the uh, the pesky, pesky, pesky overall fabricators. Let's go ahead and get them on a journey. A journey of wonder and greatness. Our catalyst destroyed, really. Now if we spawn right over here. From what I can tell, there's no bombies. Nope, there is some. There's some kestrels as well. That's not good. We're gonna need spinners. Or... Oh, shit. I've stopped producing T1 ants. Well, T1 ants. I've just been not producing ants. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna go ahead and get this out of the way. And you know what? We're gonna go ahead and also nuke yellow. Reason why is quite simple. We need to get rid of him. Tell me, Yellow, how do you want to die? We have so much eco. Why are we using it? Oh. Big giant dummy. Let's go ahead and use it on important stuff. That ain't good. Yeah, if we're gonna do this now, we're gonna have to do this right now. Give me that teleporter. Good. Okay, it's only me and Pink now. Come on. What are you waiting for? Idiots. Come on. Build. Stop proclaiming. You can build right over there. There we go. There we go. Okay.
Oh, this is bad. This is probably a loss. Yep. You probably lost this. Oh, I should have been producing more stuff. Wait, 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 wait. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. If we get out a really, really fast nuke. No, wait, that's on the other side. Okay, how about this? Get out a bunch of horrible stuff, and we can maybe just maybe try and beat back time. Oh, fuck. Nope. Too late. We got tracked. <laughs> oh. No. Shit. Pink had a lot of time to build these catalysts. He bit his time. He bit it well. Oh, God. So close, so close. How much metal did we have? Oh, wow. Wow. Oh my god. He had so much more metal than me. Oh. Hello there. Well, uh, mistakes were made. I definitely should have tried and move in on pink a little bit faster with an orbital attack. A conventional army sent in with an orbital attack and stuff, but it was too slow. Way too slow. Nukes maybe would have helped a little bit, but the problem with nukes is that he was building his catalyst really, really fast, and getting out an anti-nuke isn't exactly too difficult for him, probably, especially with the amount of fabricators he had. He was just alone for a long period of time, and he basically won. So I need to go back. I need to check something out. What happened here? Yeah, Orange just went super turtle mode. Oh god, beating back rain was difficult. Yeah, it seems like the levelers were the key. Should have built more levelers. And I probably should have left my air production. And then pink finally came in soon. Decided to wreck me. He did basically obliterate purple. Yeah, once he had the entire planet to himself, he was basically untouchable. As the game drew on, actually green was having a stronger and stronger eco. Oh, but that was because we were hit by pink during this time. Oh, and finally yellow comes in from woodworks to deal with green. Beautiful. Just beautiful. Probably should have saved up a ton of my bumblebees and then afterwards attacked the greens commander. Just with one snipe. But throughout this entire game, we've been kind of multi-pronged attacked by multiple different sides. If I had left the planet a little bit earlier and built up a little bit of a stronger eco as well as not gotten harassed by pink as much as I did, maybe it would have been a little bit better of a show. I don't know what yellow was doing. God, he could have taken all these mexes and he just chose not to. I don't know what's with the super turtle up. But, whatever. We were hampered massively during this engagement. And then we rose back to the top, but it was too late. Far too late. I was talking about getting jigs so much earlier, and yet I never got them until much later on. Oh well, my name is Asrolfus. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.